Well, hello everyone. Welcome to the vlog. I don't think I've ever vlogged from here before. I feel a little bit like David Wood sitting here. But I don't really care. I mean, I don't look like David Wood. I'm not as clever as David Wood. But I just kind of feel like the uh, aesthetic was rather similar. I have an essay due on Sunday night at midnight. Here it is, right? I don't know how your your process is when you're doing big projects, but I've printed this off. I've done the whole thing on computer, obviously, and this is the first time I've printed it off because I can't read very well without getting distracted on the old computer. What happens to me is I read, I spot something that's not right, then I immediately stop to fix it. When actually what I need to do is I need to read through the whole thing to see how it scans, to see if my arguments are actually logical to see if the whole thing actually follows and i'm not very good at doing that on the computer so i've had to print it out my last essay i got pulled up for doing the really really stupid thing and it is stupid of saying firstly i'd like to do this and then never writing secondly or thirdly just firstly so the entire essay was my firstly that's the sort of thing i'm working really hard to avoid this time so it's the first time doing one of these essays that i've actually felt like i know what's going on i have not been in proper education for like 17 years before starting this course and i know feeling like i know what's going on um, is probably quite dangerous and i do have a sneaking suspicion <laughs> i might not know what's going on at all but it's quite nice, even if it is a false sense of security, to feel a little bit like you know what's going on a bit. I don't know what um, this says about me, this bookshelf. Um, many of the books on the top shelf are missing. They're actually out on my desk at the moment. I have to reference at least 20 to 25 sources. So here's my bibliography. Loads and loads and loads of people. So I've got books for days all over the desk there. Hammerbeads. This is what happens when boys like Hammerbeads and daddy likes theology. <laughs> a Shetland Pony. I've always wanted and still want a VW Combi. One day when I grow up, I will buy one of these things and I will travel the country with Shelley. Sadly, I think the boys might be too old to join us by the time I can afford a Combi, but they can come and play flying visits. Maybe they can bring their combis too. Good old Martin Luther and Playmobil. What a lad. And lastly, <laughs> this is an old puppet uh, trophy I won. Actually, it was the first ever puppet trophy I won uh, at a competition where it was actually worth winning them anyway. Quick update on the running. I know some of you are concerned. Thank you for all the nice comments about that, by the way. Uh, I want to keep you up to date. Yes, I'm keeping up with my three runs a week. I'm doing one of these apps where they um, tell you what to do and you wear the earphones and it says run and then stop. And basically you run and walk, brisk walk, run and walk and run and walk. It's really good though. It's getting me out of the house and I'm feeling a lot better for it. One of my days looked like this. I said I wouldn't check in every week. But just in case you don't believe me, to be in for another run. That's why I ain't wearing my glasses. Don't want to lose them. <laughs> and one of my other runs looked like this. Absolutely freezing out. But getting a run in, told you I would. Very cold at the moment, very cold. Thank you, as I say, for all your kind comments. Very encouraging. If you couldn't tell, I have had a very busy week and I've struggled to find time to make a video and so I've just sat down now to make this. I hope it's okay for you. But I would like to bring back something that I just started at the end of 2017 which is my... Favourite music of the week. My favourite music this week is the wonderful Beautiful Eulogy. If you've never heard of Beautiful Eulogy before, you are genuinely missing out. I know people say that all the time about music, but for real, for real. If you've not listened to Beautiful Eulogy, and specifically their latest album, Worthy, you really are missing out. My favourite track on the album is called If, and it is classic Beautiful Eulogy. It's brilliantly well written, it's excellently executed, and uh, it sounds a little bit like this. If I have you, I could lose everything and still consider it gain. It can mean everything, it can mean nothing. One word makes the difference. You could download the album for free of Humphreys.com, their record label. The whole label gives away all the records that they make for free. All that remains to be said is if you have been, 
Thanks for watching. I make these videos every Thursday on YouTube and every Saturday on Facebook. If you like the video, why not give it a like? If you want to leave me a question or a comment, musical recommendation, or a little bit of encouragement with the running, leave me a comment in the box below. Otherwise, folks, thank you so much, and I'll see you next week. All the best. Bye. Thank you for watching Helen's weekly vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Can we watch it, Daddy? It can mean everything.